fly with us to Chicago on Continental Airlines. We'll do a little more for you a lot faster to make this the nicest flight you've ever flown. Like we say at Continental Airlines, we really move our tail for you. We really move our tail for you. To make your every wish come true. On Continental Airlines, we really move our tail for you. Dear Continental Airlines. I am disgusted as I write this note to you about a miserable situation sitting here in seat 29E on one of your aircrafts. As you may know, the seat is situated directly across from the laboratory. I'm so close that I can reach out and my left arm can touch the door. All my senses are being tortured simultaneously. It's difficult to say what the worst part about sitting in 29E really is. Is it the stench of the sanitation fluid that's blown all over my body every 60 seconds when the door opens? Is it the whoosh of the constant flushing? Or is it the passengers' asses that seem to fit into my personal space like a pornographic jigsaw puzzle? I constructed a stink shield by shoving one end of the blanket into the overhead compartment while effective in blocking at least some of the stench and offering a small bit of privacy. Jesus, the ass on my body factor has increased as without my evil glare, passengers feel free to lean up what they think is some kind of blanketed wall. The next ass that touches my shoulder will be the last. I'm picturing a boardroom full of executives giving props to the young promising engineer that figured out how to squeeze an additional row of seats onto this plane by putting them next to the laboratory. I'd like to flush his head in the toilet, which I'm close enough to touch and taste from my seat. Putting a seat here was a very bad idea. Ah! My heavens! I just heard a person groan in there! This sucks! Worst yet is I've paid over $400 for the honor of sitting in this seat! Does your company give refunds? I'd like to go back where I came from and start over! <laughs> Seat 29E could only be worse if it was located inside the bathroom. I wonder if my clothing will retain the sanitizing odor. What about my hair? I feel like I'm bathing in a toilet bowl of blue liquid and there's no little man or little boat to save me. I am filled with a deep hatred for your plane, designers, and a general disease that may last for hours. We are finally descending, and soon I'll be able to tear down this stink shield, but the scars will remain. I suggest that you initiate immediate removal of the seat from all of your aircrafts. Just remove it. Just remove it. Just, just, just remove it. And, and leave the smoldering brown hole empty. A good place for sturdy, non-absorbing luggage, maybe, but definitely not human cargo. Signed, You Stink. Ladies and gentlemen, we have just landed at Ninoy Aquino International Airport, Cebu Pacific Air. Welcome to Two Manila. On behalf of your flight deck crew, headed by Captain J. Ariap with First Officer Ariap Paren. <laughs> <laughs>